my strong opposition to President Trump's shameful decision to invite Turkish President Erdogan to the White House tomorrow. It's a decision that has alarmed our allies. It's a decision that undermines our values and our national security interests. And it's a decision that sends a terrible message to the world. In just the last five weeks, Turkish President Erdogan has taken the following actions. One, launched an attack on a key ally of ours, in fact, the key ally in our fight against ISIS terrorists, the Syrian Democratic Forces led by the Syrian Kurds. Two, President Erdogan and his forces have killed over 200 in these attacks, displaced over 300,000, and enabled the release of over 100 ISIS prisoners. Three, Erdogan is using jihadi proxies that include a lot of al-Qaeda elements, and they are committing gross human rights abuses, including what the Trump administration has acknowledged are war crimes. There are also reports that the Turkish-backed uh, proxy forces are using chemical agents, white phosphorus. Four, Erdogan has boasted, boasted that he organized a hit squad to assassinate the top commander of our Syrian Kurdish allies. The commander is General Mazlum, and President Erdogan did that even after President Trump acknowledged that our Syrian Kurdish allies had given us important information that helped us kill ISIS leader Baghdadi.